Hello and welcome. Again, it's time to continue the Kerbal Carrier mode today. Uh, last time we managed to do the Minmus landing and we unlocked a crap ton of science. So today I will be doing unlocks with the science and seeing what we get out of those. And probably some uh, plane making and maybe a rescue mission uh, that I have in mind. But let's uh, get into the game immediately, I guess, and see what's there to unlock now. So, the Minmus landing mission gave me almost thousand science points, and uh, it's gonna be great to unlock stuff with that. Uh, I've been trying to scrunch together like ninety science to get like one of these landing gears and uh, other stuff, and now we suddenly have nine hundred and forty-five science, which means we can unlock a lot of stuff today. Uh, one of the biggest things uh, that has been annoying me while building the planes has been <laughs> the lack of actual wheels or gears, gear base for the planes. And having those would be kinda useful. So this is gonna be my immediate first <laughs> unlock <laughs> to get. Also taking this path this way gives me the rower parts and uh, that's something I really want to do as well. Hey Night Basilisk. So the rover parts are here and they actually need uh, advanced exploration and advanced landing. We have the exploration here and I think the landing is here. So I'm just gonna get, go and uh, grab the small gear base so we can actually do some planes now. A bit better. There we go. And there's the advanced landing which gives us the bigger landing strut I think is this one. And another parachute, nice. Deploys high up, certainly not enough to stop you smashing into the ground on its own. It was useful for slowing heavy craft down before deploying the fair main chutes. Hmm, interesting. Could be useful. I'm not sure if I want to spend that much science on that yet, though. Uh, what was here? Delta Deluxe Winglet. Hmm. Inline Advanced Stabilizer. Spin this are going fast. Cockpit. And something else. Delta winglets. Fuselage. This is the one I want for the planes as well. Better wings, fuselage. Uh, adapters. Engine. For increased fuel flow to connect it. Engine. Ex exhaust systems. Nice. Radial engine body. Yeah, that's probably what I need as well. You need better rockets or to learn how to get into orbit better. Yeah, me, me too, Rayman. <laughs> that asparagus staging would be a great idea to learn to do and get. Hmm. Structural fuselage. Brand adapter. Let's get the... I don't know. That going there for the rovers would take 460 signs which is, which is a lot I think we should uh, unlock some of these I want the airplanes here as well hmm. flight control the flight control actually doesn't you don't need these advanced flight controls for this one hmm yeah Rayman I, I don't know maybe we are just not experienced enough <laughs> rocket builders yet I'm sure we'll get there soon. I guess I'll just waste the science. Because uh, I, I want these rover parts. And I want the planes. And we, we can just uh, grab more science by doing a min another Minmus landing or actual moon landing. That would be n nice to do. So let's get the advanced landing for the bigger strut and this another parachute. Ouch, that hurts. The science. And uh, these field science modules for the row rowers. So we could actually... Next time we land in Minimus or something... We're gonna go and land. Uh, a rower there. No, I don't land. Uh, the rocket parts are up here and I definitely don't have those. And we should probably get <laughs> the rocket parts <laughs> to get better rockets. Uh, especially the orange 
fuel tanks would be nice. Mm, I'm gonna un unlock this because I wanna do some new plane stuff. Hey DJ Bump, it's going really well. <laughs> I wanna do some planes today, so gears for the planes, some better and more plane parts, advanced aerodynamics, hmm, adapter, aerodynamic nose cones, wing connector, a weekly wing shape board, use at all your risk, <laughs> structural pylon, engine support, hmm, and structural wing, surplus wing components, 300 signs to get there, mm. it's a choice between this and this. The science station sucks. Don't use it on your rocket. Might be okay on a base station, but not for a rocket. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, it, I, I saw it. It's pretty damn large. These are the precision engineering ones. I don't really need those yet. Uh, these other... Those would be nice. Hmm. All these options. I'm 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 gonna go with this. <laughs> Let's see. Gravmax ne negative gravioli <laughs> detector. So this is probably more science. I should go for the more science things as soon as possible to unlock more stuff and get more science. I still content that this game is too smart for me. <laughs> me too, they did about. I'm I'm just uh winging it and seeing what happens. Sensor array competing nose cone. Hmm. Quality sensors. Ah, quality sensors. <laughs> and computer selves from high. Atmospheric. Ah, we need this one. That's a lot of science getting those. It's large and it is heavy and it is weak. <laughs> yeah. Advanced rotors. Bigger wheels. All these things I want. I need more science. We should probably get the rocket parts as well. And uh, some of these advanced construction ones. Uh, so these don't uh, lag behind that much. And uh, I want this one as well. <laughs> for the more plane parts. Uh, let's unlock this heavy rocketry here and see what op that opens. It gives us a poodle liquid engine which seems pretty weak. I don't know. Could be nice. It's an option. And it gives us heavier rocketry. So, bigger fuel tanks and... Skipper. <laughs> Rivals that of a large city is combined high thrust with reasonable efficiency of this engine excels when used as a mid-state boos booster. Hmm. Could be nice. It doesn't land well. <laughs> Uh, did you see uh, Rayman? Uh, I mean Rayman. Did you see Nakus stream yesterday? He was uh, flying uh, those in the moon and building a moon base out of those, and he he was doing pretty well with those. That lander he had for the magical mystery science bus <laughs> was kind of strange. I, I I would advise taking a look at that if you haven't, because. It was pretty neat. Delta Deluxe Winglet is a large iron wing surf with a small wind build aileron. Hmm. Inliner. I should probably get these as well. Or these. Uh, uh. I'm gonna get this and uh, we'll unlock these when we get some more signs. Yes, uh, DJ Bone, you can. Nahko is uh, doing one at the moment. He was uh, scouting and planning and flying some first parts there yesterday. I don't know how far he went. Uh, I couldn't watch the whole thing yesterday. Let's up unlock that. And it opens high altitude flight. Turbojet engine. Small hard point. Ram air intake. Mm. That would be nice. Yeah, it's a moda just at the moment. Hopefully it will be one at some point part of the full full game. Because uh, 
doing multiplayer would be amazing. Ouch, that sucks, Rayman. Yeah, that, 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 that would be annoying. I actually forgot to take the backup saves today. I've been uh, backupping my saves every time before I start the stream. So if there's a problem, uh, I at least have the previous days save. Well, okay, I guess that's that's the unlocks for now. When we get some more science, I'll, no I'll unlock this one to see what's opening here. And I want all of these, all of these, and those. These are. Mm, these would be amazing. Field science and electronics. I guess I need to electronics from this side to unlock these. This would be nice. Oh well. So let's go uh, build a plane. Actually, uh, let me show you. Um, I did something off stream yesterday uh, for future stuff. Uh, I <laughs> crashed my fun plane on the island out here, and uh, Ordin was on it, and Ordin is now, there's the fun plane parts, the cockpit, and Ordin is now stranded on this island here. This is just off the coast, whoa, coast of uh, the main island here. Let me show you. Can you zoom enough? This way. So, there's the Kerbal landing, I mean the space station, uh, space center here. And there's this island over here. So I crashed uh, the fun plane here. And Ordin is now on this island. And uh, I intentionally got him stuck here so I can do a rescue mission. And uh, I'll build a plane, land it here, have two seater on it, and I'll get Ordin on the plane and fly him home. I could just recover the plane, like Raymond says, but uh, I want to keep him here and do an actual rescue mission on the planet, Kerbin, instead of just uh, recovering him. So, uh, this is intentional rescue mission that I created uh, for today. So I'll be building some planes today with the new parts. Yeah, Raymond, it's just a kind of practice or just just for fun. Um, but first I'll be building a, a science plane. So I had this stupid idea of building a plane with tons and tons of uh, science stuff on it. Ooh, actually. Before we go there, let's do let's do a rover. And we should not do it here. Uh, let's go into the space. Spacecrafting. Thanks, uh, Kyle O'Brien, for the follow. Actually, mm, let's do the plane first. We have time today. <laughs> Too many options. Too indecisive. So, a science plane. I'm gonna be using this new cockpit, it seems. Because, well, it's new. Instead of this this one. We could probably do a two-seater. If we really wanted. <laughs> have a two kerbals on it. I don't, I don't see point for that. <laughs> really, but. Could do it. Do we actually have a nose cone that fits that? Radial engine body... Circular intake, hmm. Ooh, twice as much air than those puny air scoops. Those are... these are pretty good. I've been having air issues with my engines. So actually having those would be nice. Uh, I, don't, I don't think I have proper nose cone yet for this plane. Yeah, it seems uh, we are lacking on the no nose department. Oh well, that's a nose. 
there we go. That's the front of the plane. <laughs> Maybe I sh should go with the uh, normal cockpit for now. Well, it's a next generation. Hmm. Screw it. We will do two seater. It's a science uh, vessel. It has to have multiple kerbals on it. Engine nacelle. This engine body features ram air intake for increased uh, fuel flow to connected engine exhaust systems. Increased fuel flow. Hmm. How big is this? This looks like an air intake to me, more than a fuel. Like the air intake is there. Ram air index for increased fuel. Okay, yes, it is. I wonder uh, how, how big the difference with this and this is. Um, let's see. I was planning about using one of these uh, tricoupler things. Oops. So the mid part is actually that one now. And, uh. Rocket. We actually have fuselage now. Nice. Ooh, that's, that's handy. Hmm. Let me actually rethink this. We have Delta wings. that part off. Okay, that doesn't really fit there properly. Do I need to put like... Uh, that's probably the adapter, yeah. Let me... Let me actually just throw those away. That's my wife blowing her nose on the background, by the way. <laughs> if you're wondering what the sound is. Nobody told me I had a piece. Looks pretty sleek. How do I strap the engines on this? I could uh, have the engines below the wings. That would actually be a nice idea. Hmm. I'm gonna need a decoupler here. Still don't know where the parts are properly. Decoupler on that. Just just for safety. And have parachutes on this. So that's just for safety, if I need to save the gear ball when it explodes. And uh, I was thinking about slapping like million of these science juniors on this and Mr. Goo. on this. That's that's annoying. Let me It's gonna be super not aerodynamic. 
There we go. Yeah, it's uh, not just Minimus. <laughs> that was, uh, it, it has a bit, bit of other stuff as well, like going to the moon as well. But the Minimus landing is the highlight of the day from yesterday. <laughs> so sorry about not, not mentioning that as well. the angle snap on these as well. How is my... Well, actually, let me get this first in a good spot. Let's look at the weight. It's kind of in the middle that still. It's like a fake spoiler. <laughs> yeah. Kinda, kinda. <laughs> Not was Sorry about that. Those actually have uh, their own uh, turning things already. Nice. So I don't actually need probably this at all. Hmm. But I, I, I do need uh, these. And I, I still miss my engines as well, so... Some smooth, smoother jazz building music. Can I get those in there? Oh. Uh, well, now it's somewhere in there, I think. No. <laughs> Let's cancel that. Uh, I lost a nose cone there. <laughs> Can I do it uh, without mirroring? Oh well, it's gonna not happen then. Um, I'm gonna put the engines below the wings, I think. Oh, there's the nose gun. Found it. So this one will have eight science thingies. That's probably an overkill by a lot. Um, I think. How are those? Um, hmm. Let me see. Landing gears, these small gear base. They are they are small. That is kind of good assumption. They are small. So that's that's my wheels. Radial engine power. This engine body features radiator flaps and coals to help cool air breathing high performance engines. Hmm what's, what's the difference with these? It's kind of annoying that it doesn't tell you the difference. Oh, there is right mass button. More info. Intake resource area. Intake. Intake area. Amount. 0.2. This one is 0.5. And this one is 0.2. Interesting. Oh, the intake area and the intake amount hmm, is different as well. This one looks the best. This one doesn't have any more info, that sucks. Hey, Half Dunskin. I still need to strap the engines on this as well. Oh, 
is this? Round defined monopropeller tank. Hmm. Fuel tanks. Thinking about having a mid engine there. How's it going, Half Dunskin? Getting it there would be kind of difficult, though, I think. I need to do it differently. <laughs> How's it going, Half Dunskin? <sighs> Getting these to snap together is like a nightmare. It's easiest to just uh, pick it apart and uh, still done. Doesn't work. And <laughs> not not even connected. That's perfect. I mean, I'm just gonna space tape it together. I don't, I don't think I'll actually get this in the middle. Um, if I don't put some decouplers on it, how's it going, uh, Rave Killer?